an incredible 1956 Chevrolet. This is a show quality resto mod. Finished in absolutely gorgeous Inca silver metallic and gray metallic. The body on the car is laser straight. And as you can see, the paint is show quality. All the chrome and bright work on the car looks like new. Riding on American Racing mags with brand new Redline steel belted radial tires. Really sets this car off beautifully. The molding, I don't know if you can see it, also has a little bit of red pinstriping in it to coordinate and tie together with the tires. Gives these two colors a real shot in the arm. The interior is absolutely gorgeous. It's like a gray tweed material. Headliner. The seats, the door panels. The dash. We're told it's actually a Bel Air dash, although this is not a Bel Air car, but when it was restored, they utilized a Bel Air dash. It looks absolutely gorgeous. It's all show quality. The carpeting, I don't know if you can see it in this lighting, is as new, just like the seats and everything else inside the car. I like it because they still kept the original type steering wheel. It looks like brand new. Keeps some originality to the car. The dash looks very similar to when Chevrolet built it does have custom gauges down there. It has uh, a hidden stereo system under the, the seat and an in-dash stereo cassette system. Beautiful show car. Try to give you some perspective of the car here. This car is powered by a fresh ZZ4 factory crate motor, small block producing 300 and factory, 385 factory rated horsepower. This car will absolutely go. It's a pleasure to drive. It also has a four speed automatic, so you can take it out on the highway for those long cruises. Won't wear the car out, but when you want to go, this baby will rock and roll. Matter of fact, Matt, can we start it up? Yeah, baby. Oh yeah, Chevrolet muscle right there. Love the Tri-5 Chevy. This car is show detailed underneath as well. It's just as pretty underneath as it is on top. Let's take a peek inside. All right, Matt, why don't you move your hands there so we can see. I love the fact they kept the original type speedometer in the car. So many people go to the analog gauges and it, I don't know, you know, you want to keep some of the, uh, the vintage appeal of these cars. This one also has ice cold, fat, not factory, but vintage air conditioning in the car as well. You got power steering, power four wheel disc brakes, uh, air conditioning, and a fresh GM crate motor. I don't know what more you could want out of a car. There it is right there. There's your power disc brake booster. It is power steering. All fresh aluminum billet pieces under the hood. Valve covers, air cleaner, all chromed up on the uh, alternator. Fresh uh, uh, aluminum radiator in the car. Keep it from overheating. And electric cooling fan. This car was built to go. It'll go to the show or anywhere else you want to go. And it'll take you there in great style. We are Fleming's Ultimate Garage in Rockville, Maryland, 301-816-1000. Yeah, baby.